OG Esports is about to get eliminated from TI by a baby. Let me explain. Earlier today, OG made a post on Twitter how they might have to exit the TI qualifiers early due to their up and coming young star, Seb, having a child. Disclaimer, it is his wife that is having the child, not Seb, so get that image out of your head. OG explains how they're trying to fight against this process, but it's without a doubt an uphill battle, with many players taking the side of PGL. Snake King, a former TI winner, stated that the rules are the rules. Whether a rule is appropriate or not should be discussed before the tournament has started. Once you have agreed to participate in said tournament, you have agreed to the rules of said tournament. The tournament organizer had even given a concession of allowing a stand-in for one day. If OG isn't happy with this concession, they should have made a public issue before, which they didn't do. On the contrary, they committed with this roster of five for this tournament, fully aware of the consequences of their actions. It is now for OG to face the consequences of their actions. They had an opportunity to protest harder before the tournament or commit a different roster. At PGL Esports should not change the rules midway through a tournament if modifications of the rules are allowed. If modifications of rules are allowed in the middle of a tournament, it completely jeopardizes the competitive integrity of said tournament, especially when at Dota TI is at stakes. This is the last tournament that its competitive integrity should be put into question. Now I understand and respect Snake King's take that the rules are the rules and they should be respected and kept held. And while I do see some truth in this, to me, this seems like a very black and white take. We're not robots, everybody. We're human beings. We're caring. We're compassionate. We're intelligent. We're creative. We're stupid. And I know you know this because think of your teammates from this past week. Oh boy, do they really make you question the intelligence of the entire human race. The point is, is that we're not perfect. And that's okay. Like, sure, could OG have done the extra homework a few months ago to make sure that this problem didn't happen? Probably. But if there's ever gonna be a reason that a player gets an excused absence from a series, it's this one. I know no one's asking for my opinion, but I truly believe we should treat Seb with the same courtesy that we would hope to be treated if we found ourselves in a similar situation. But obviously, all of this is up for debate. Let me know what you think in the comments what OG's fate should be. Unrelated note, but just like the members of OG, you are human too. You you don't need to do this thing or that thing to be enough. Just the fact that you're here and you're present today makes you enough. Be kind to yourself, love yourself, forgive yourself, and especially screw that inner voice that tells you you can't have that second bowl of ice cream. Yes, you can! Just Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch this video. It means the world to me. I've been cooking up a lot of videos that are going to be dropping this week, next week, the week after. So be sure to slap that subscribe button in the freaking face. And as always, I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace out.